Now to our GMA cover story and a new warning about why wearing your mask below your nose could put you and those nearby at risk for COVID-19. Trevor Hall joins us with more on the new study saying why the half mask could be dangerous. Good morning, Trevor. Well, good morning, George. You know, these half maskers are a common sight. Yesterday, we counted 11 of them on a single street corner in less than an hour. And this morning, researchers are stressing if you don't wear your mask correctly and cover up your nose, you're defeating the purpose. We've seen the incredible amount of particles that can come out of our mouths just from speaking. But this morning, researchers say when it comes to getting infected, they have their eye on the nose. Things likely start in the nose, and the nose basically is the purveyor of all viral ill. A group of 43 researchers at the University of North Carolina mapped locations in the respiratory tract to see where COVID-19 most likely infiltrates the body. They found the cells that line the nose may be more likely to become infected with the virus than the throat or lungs. The virus appeared to uh, pick the nose as a fertile ground for infection. This picture from the study shows different parts of the respiratory system after being infected with the same amount of the virus. More green dots in the nasal cavity, researchers say indicating many more cells infected in the nose. Remember, we've only known about this virus for about seven or eight months. So the more we learn about the mechanism of how the virus causes infection in humans is key. I think this study is important. And public officials have warned us. Right, but this is a mask. This is a chin guard. Saying covering your nose with a mask is just as important as your mouth. Wearing a mask if you're infected and how you'll protect your fellow citizens. The inverse is also true. If you're wearing a mask, you'll protect yourselves. Now, researchers say part of the reason you could be more likely to get infected through your nose is because the nose has a higher number of cellular docking sites for the virus. The doctor we talked to put it more simply. He referred to your nose as the grand central station of viral infection. Cecilia. I'm just going to let that sit there for a second, Trevor. Yeah. Okay, yeah. Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the morning on GMA.